Hey there, thank you so much for coming back to watch this week's hair care review. I'm sorry if I'm talking too loud or too soft. Um, I haven't, yeah, my ear's been effed up for like a year and so I have to wear like these special silicone, anyway. Yeah, yeah no one cares. Okay, so today um, I'm going to be trying for the first time, so this is the first impressions, the Aloe Botanica So Smooth Shampoo and Conditioner. So if you'd like to see if these are any good, some of the claims, uh, all that kind of stuff, then please keep on watching. Okay. So if you watched my uh, clearance hair care haul, then you saw these. I got these for a buck a piece at my local Kroger. And um, I've tried Aloe Botanica face cream before. And it was decent. Um, so this is for frizzy flyaway hair. It's healthier looking hair um, and filling hair with every wash. Um, it has no animal testing, artificial colors, parabens, phthalates, or sulfates. It's 100% vegetarian ingredients, pH balanced which is awesome. So, um, yeah, I, I like it. Um, this is supposed to be gardenia scented and it's supposed to give you smooth, uh, smooth, smooth, sleek hair. Um, yeah. Okay. Let's just go and try this. It's been like three days since I washed my hair Had Botox and then yeah, it's just, it's been a thing. So I think this is like, it doesn't look dirty, but oh boy, does it feel dirty. I'm not excited to try the shampoo. Let's see what it smells like. Oh yeah, I remember smelling it. It smells good. A little watery. But yeah, watery, but it's okay. Let's try it. Okay, so it does sud some. With some sulfate-free shampoos, I do feel like I have to use a little bit more than I usually would, but I still gotta get under here, so. I'm fine with not, you know, doing my ends and everything, but I need to do wherever, you know, my hair is coming out of my scalp, so. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and let it sit, do its thing. Um, I'll come back when it's rinsed. Um, we'll talk about the shampoo a little bit more and then uh, I'll try the conditioner. Okay, so shampoo rinsed out nicely. Uh, so while I was waiting for it to do its thing, I was reading the ingredients. So the very first ingredient is like water. Um, it's some kind of sodium something, um, but it's not sodium lauryl sulfate, so it's not that. Um, Let's see, lots of like cocoa, glucicide. So once again, I think it's like more natural ingredients. We have um, papaya fruit extract, we have pineapple extract, ginger, let's see. Yeah, okay, and fragrance is really, really low on the list. It smells good, but it's not like out of, the, out of control or anything like that. So, okay. So I'm just gonna be using conditioner on my ends. Um, the lid was broken. So, like, it won't close, it won't snap shut. So, anyway, it's still thick though. Okay, smells just as good as the as the shampoo. Okay, let's go ahead and try this just on the ends. Okay, so, so far um, I like the shampoo, um, it's, that's pretty well for being sulfate free. Conditioner, thick, it thick. Um, I think it will do a good job. Um, I will see you here, not here, um, I always air dry my hair, like 99% of the time, so especially when I'm doing um, shampoo and conditioner reviews, I like to air dry my hair. So the next time you'll see, you see me, I will have dry hair and it will be air dried. Um, the regular spill is I don't use any kind of like leave-in conditioner or smoothing serum or anything like that. When I'm doing a review, I'm only using the products that I'm showing. So it's just gonna be the Apple Botanica So Smooth Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, so yeah, I'll show you what my hair looks like dry and I'll give you my final thoughts on the shampoo and conditioner, but so far, 
it seems pretty decent, so I am definitely excited. So I'll see you here in a little bit. All right, so this is what my hair looks like dry. I have to say it looks really, really shiny. I was expecting maybe a little bit more softness, but I'm totally okay with it just because the conditioner does have sunflower seed oil in it and sunflower seed oil can be a little heavy, but um, I think it turned out really nice looking. Um, I'm impressed with it. I like that it's sulfate free. If you do color your hair, it's obviously gonna preserve your hair color life. Um, but yeah, I'm impressed with the Alba Botanica um, so, so Smooth Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, it smells really good. I can still smell a little bit of it. And um, it did leave my hair really, really soft. So, and really, really shiny. And actually pretty smooth. Not a lot of flyaways, which is good. So, I'm impressed. I do like that they're um, vegetarian. I don't know why they're not vegan, but there must be something in there. You know, but I'd like that they're not tested on animals, that they're sulfate-free, phthalate-free, all that kind of stuff. So a little bit of a cleaner shampoo and conditioner, and I do think it did a good job. I think it enhanced my waves, and I'm impressed. So if you're looking for a new shampoo and conditioner, this stuff does regularly retail for about $5, which honestly for 12 fluid ounces isn't too bad for the drugstore. So yeah, if you're looking for a cleaner brand, I would definitely recommend Alba Botanica. It seems pretty decent, and I'm impressed. And I will continue to reuse this because I do like it a lot. So really, really good shampoo and conditioner. And I'm glad I picked it up for a buck a piece. So anyway, there we go. Um, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, if you did, go ahead and give the video a thumbs up. Share it. Let me know down below in the comments what shampoo and conditioner are you using right now. I would love to know down below. And if you did enjoy today's video, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. I do upload seven days a week. All about budget beauty. It's not just like physical beauty. I'm doing like weight loss vlogs, um, home decor, all sorts of stuff. So if that sounds cool, then make sure you subscribe. You're also welcome to follow me on my other social media. I have TikTok, Facebook, and Instagram. I'll link them down below um, for you so that we can easily find it. I'll go ahead and put these in the products tab. Um, that way it's for ease of shopping. But I appreciate you stopping by. I hope you did enjoy. Um, another video should start auto playing here in a moment. It might be one of mine. It might be somebody else's, but sit back, relax and enjoy. And I'll see you here in just a sec.